Woodsong's Kids is funded in part by the Kentucky Department of Tourism. Information about the lakes, mountains, parks, sports, music, art festivals, and more is available online at kentuckytourism.com. By the Martin Guitar Company, building handcrafted guitars for professionals and front porch pickers since 1833. Online at martinguitars.com. And by the Daring Banjo Company, making American-made handcrafted banjos. Their full catalog of banjos is online at DeeringBanjos.com. With Songs Kids, celebrating the music of America's front porch from the Lyric Theater in Lexington, Kentucky. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, my name is Michaela Rain Jonathan. Welcome to Wood Songs Kids. Here is my daddy, folk singer Michael Jonathan. Thank you, Michaela. We're going to play a little song together. Ready? Sitting on a creaky old rocking chair. You say it's going to rain. We don't care. I'm dancing with you all afternoon on the front porch with me. Listen to the rhythm of the summer rain Tapping on the tempo on my window pane Nothing like summer on the front porch swing Making my banjo ring I'm playing my banjo on a rocking chair You can play a fill in your underwear Just the pretty as a rainbow in your hair On the front porch with me When you're on the front porch with me Good, Michaela. And welcome, everybody, to another edition of Wood Songs Kids. We're broadcasting all over North America, around the world, celebrating the wonderful front porch music of these kids that come from everywhere to be on our broadcast. We celebrate their music. We also celebrate the calm uh, spirit of what the front porch is all about. We tell the kids all the time that you don't have to be perfect, you just have to be having a lot of fun. And that's the whole point of Wood Songs Kids to encourage kids, even grown ups, to pick up an instrument and play. Mr. Rogers said it best. He said, listening is where love begins, and so we want you to sit back for the next 30 minutes and listen to these amazing kids. We're going to start out with a youngster from Wisconsin. He's going to do a, a great old-timey tune called Rocky Top on his banjo. Please welcome Aiden Muse, 10 years old, on Woodsong's Kids. Top 
He's 10 years old on the banjo. Aiden Muse, all the way from Wisconsin. It's nice to have you here, Aiden. Thanks for coming on. Now, how old were you when you started playing the banjo? I was nine years old when I nine started. Nine years. Playing. So just you've only been playing for a year, year and a half, right? Uh, about two years. About two, two years. years. So, so how would you get so good so fast? I guess you have to have a good teacher, right? At a bluegrass festival, I met Mr. Gary. So we texted him asking um, if he knew any banjo teachers. Um, and we didn't think he was going to reply, but then about an hour later, he said, I think you have potential. I'll teach him. So um, from that point on, um, Mr. Geary has been teaching me. So Gary Biscuit Davis, who's a fine, fine banjo player on his own. So you've got a very good mentor, right, that's, that's helping you. What's, tell the kids watching this show, what, what is the most fun thing about the banjo? What do you love about it the most? I um, love introducing this instrument to others who've never seen it before. Well, we're going to talk some more about that, and we're going to give you a chance to uh, give some of that joy to the, to the audience. You're going to play a song. Now, you're 10 years old, and you're going to do a tune called How Mountain Girls Can Love. <laughs> now, this is, this is a kind of an interesting song for a 10-year-old to do. What, what's your interest in this song? You got a girlfriend? No. Um, <laughs> I thought this was a really good song, and I thought it would match my voice and so it has nothing to do with about about a 10 year old uh, finding himself a mountain girlfriend right no um <laughs> and i generally enjoy listening um ricky's gags to the version of the song i generally enjoy listening well let's go ahead and listen to your version of it how mountain girls can love he's 10 years old from wisconsin aiden muse on wood songs kids <laughs> String banjo, Aiden Muse, 10 years old, all the way from Wisconsin to be on the Wood Songs broadcast in our home base here at the Lyric Theater, the beautiful Lyric Theater in our hometown of Lexington, Kentucky. So, Aiden, you came all the way from Wisconsin, you're playing the banjo, and you said uh, before this song that one of the things you love is being able to share the joy of music, right? 
But what's, that's one of the good things. What is one of the hard things? Tell, tell other kids watching, even grown-ups, that might want to play the banjo. What's the hardest part about playing the banjo? Um, the hardest thing can be a lot of people will say no if you want to play, or no, you're not good enough, <laughs> can't do that. Well, why would they say that? Well, because... How are you supposed to learn unless people let you play? If you hear people say that, you just got to push past that. Have you, people told you no when you wanted to play the banjo? Have people told you no before? Um, no. <laughs> um, I will say the toughest thing for me, though, playing banjo, since I live in Wisconsin, that's not really a big hot spot for banjo, so <laughs> I, I don't get a lot of recognition there. So. I think since you're like one of the only banjo players, you should have a lot of recognition there. Because especially because you're very, very good at what you're doing. Thank you. I'd... Now, <clears throat> there's something on a banjo called a capo. So let's get the camera to come in nice and close to the capo and show everybody what a capo is. It's like a tight bar that goes on the strings. It helps allow, um, change the key. Mm -hmm. Now you're going to play a song where you're not going to use the capo at all, right? Yes, I am. You check in the tuning. Every time you move that capo, you got to check your tuning, right? This is a tune called Theme Time. It's a great banjo tune. Aiden Muse, 10 years old, on Wood Songs Kids. So good. Aiden Muse, 10 years old, all the way from Wisconsin on Wood Songs Kids. If you have a youngster that you think belongs on our broadcast, we'd love to hear from you. If you're a parent or guardian, you just go to the Wood Songs website, click on the Kids TV page, and you'll have all the contact information there. Just send us a little uh, YouTube clip, something nice and simple. We look at everything that comes in because we are so proud of these kids that are spending their time to learn this wonderful world of music. And it's like Bill Monroe said, uh, that, that this kind of music has made more friends than any other kind of music in the world, and we're so glad that these kids can be our friends. We want them to be your friends, too, including our next artist, who's coming to us uh, from uh, uh, all the way from Knoxville, Tennessee, and he's a guitar player, and he has a lot of heroes. A guitar, for those of you that don't know, the guitar is about a 1,000 years old. It's one of the most popular instruments in the world, but wait till you hear this 14-year-old boy from Knoxville, Tennessee. He's going to do a tune called Angelina. I'm sorry, he's going to do Windy and Warm to start off. Please welcome Sawyer Cook, 14, on Wood Songs Kids. <laughs>
Very good. Playing the guitar, he's 14 years old. His name is Sawyer Cook, all the way from Knoxville, Tennessee. How you doing, Sawyer? Good. Now, you started playing the guitar when you were about, what, 10 years old? Yeah. What, as a 10-year-old kid, what attracted you to the guitar? What was happening that made you notice the guitar and say, boy, I want to try that? Well, I started out playing piano, and I didn't really get into it. But then I went to a Stephen Curtis Chapman concert, mm -hmm. And I saw him playing the guitar, and I was just, like, amazed by what he did. And so you wanted to pick it up. Now, did you go to your parents and say, hey, I want to learn the guitar, and they immediately got you a guitar? Um, no, I, uh, <laughs> I bought myself a $60 Rogue guitar. <laughs> yeah, now, that's not an easy thing to play, because they're hard to keep in tune, right? Yeah. So when did you get your first good instrument? Um, I got this one about two years ago. Okay. During the summer? And that's about the time you started getting interested in something called thumb picking. Mm -hmm. Now, what, what is thumb picking? It's, it's a style of guitar playing, but tell, tell the audience that, that are tuning in, what is thumb picking? So I have a thumb pick, and I use it to play. I tend to use the thumb pick to play a bass line. And then I use the fingers to add a melody. Kind of muting it with the palm, with the palm of your hand, right? Yeah, I use my palm to mute the bass so it doesn't like ring out over the melody. Like now, artists like uh, Merle Travis mm -hmm. made that a very popular. Chet Atkins, right? Yep, made it very very popular. And then there's that fella from uh, Australia. What's his name again? Tommy Emmanuel. Right, everybody loves Tommy Emmanuel, and he he was a big influence on you too, right? Yes. Well, let's hear some more of your music, and we'll talk some more about your guitar and thumb picking. This is a great tune. Everybody's going to know this one. It's called "I'll Fly Away." He's 14 years old from Knoxville, Tennessee. Sawyer Cook on Wood Songs Kid. Sawyer Cook is 14 years old from Knoxville, Tennessee. Now, uh, you learned how to play that way in es essentially in 24 months, right? You started thumb picking a couple years ago, and this was like a fast thing for you to, to learn. But was it easy? I mean, did you have to spend a lot of time just playing the same thing over and over again until you got it? Well, at first, when I saw people doing it, I thought it would be really, really hard to do. But then when Yeah, I that looks so easy. Yeah. They're really <laughs> But when I started to do it, like I saw I watched this video of a tutorial for mm -hmm. a song and the guy who did the tutorial really like broke it down like step like note by note mm -hmm. really slowly so it that really helped a lot. 
So it shows that when you're patient with yourself, you can learn quickly. Yes. You have to be patient. Patience makes things go faster, right? Yes. It sounds odd when you think about it, but it's, that's how learning works, right? The more patient you are, the quicker you're going to be able to learn. Mm -hmm. So let's go to um, a song that you wrote. I want you to go ahead and play. This is an original tune. It's called Ride Away. And so you're 14 years old. You're already writing your own songs, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, 14 years old, Sawyer Cook on Wood Songs Kids. that himself is called right away he's only 14 years old from Knoxville Tennessee Sawyer Cook that's that's a intricate piece of music and those bell-like tones that the audience is hearing what are they called they're called harmonics they're harmonics that you do on the guitar and you're really stretching your fingers to do that right <laughs> yeah. now I'm gonna let you play one more song uh, on our show this is a tune that Tommy has made pretty popular it's a song called Angelina. He's from Knoxville, Tennessee. He's playing all by himself on his own guitar. This is a 14-year-old Sawyer Cook right here on Wood Songs Kids. Thank you. 
Sawyer cooking his guitar. Wasn't he wonderful? All the way from Knoxville, Tennessee. And Aiden Muse, 10 years old from Wisconsin, on his uh, banjo as well. We're so grateful to all of our Wood Songs kids. You know, Aristotle said it best. He says, children are unripe and they're imperfect. And that's why we tell kids everywhere, you don't have to be perfect. You just have to have a lot of fun. And we're so grateful for all these kids that come on Wood Songs kids and have a lot of fun. We want to thank everybody, right, Michaela? Go ahead. Thank you for watching our show. We'll be back next week for more Wood Songs Kids. <laughs> Closed captioning provided by visitlex.com. Wood Songs Kids is funded in part by the Kentucky Department of Tourism. Information about the lakes, mountains, parks, sports, music, art festivals, and more is available online at kentuckytourism.com. By the Martin Guitar Company, building handcrafted guitars for professionals and front porch pickers since 1833. Online at martinguitars.com. And by the Daring Banjo Company, making American-made handcrafted banjos. Their full catalog of banjos is online at DaringBanjos.com. <laughs>